Hey guys, and welcome back to Undertale. So here we are, under everything, figuring out what's going on. We Last we left off, we were in the thick of it. There are golden flowers down... Wow, oh, it just hit me. I'll continue my thought in just a moment. Uh, we came down here, found Alphys doing all... Found out Alphys had been doing some very, very inspired tests on monsters, trying to create some sort of mu mutant human monster hybrid, something that wasn't either of them. And the thought that I just had because of these and the videotapes, what if Alphys, like, turned somebody into Flowey? Right. What if, what if one of them was Flowey? And apparently, I knew them at some point because they they knew my name. It's weird. It's a weird, very uncomfortable thought. Anyway, uh, so back through here, I suppose. L Luckily, there's no like random encounters. It just that's new. I'm gonna save again. That wasn't like that. Just a regular suspicious bed now. Oh, because I pulled that one down. Okay. It's a bed. So, Alphys tried to combine several monster souls. And I don't think she was successful. In fact, I think she was unsuccessful on a lot of attempts. So we're gonna save here. This is... This looks like final dungeon boss area, so... What's this? Seems like another elevator has lost its power. Okay. Seems to be turned off. Oh boy. Seems like the controls to the elevator's power. Yes. What? Um. Guys? Guys, come on. Seriously, guys, we. We talked about this, yeah? We were. We were good friends. Hey! Stop! I got you guys some food, okay? Sorry about that. They kind of get sassy when I don't... then I don't get fed on time. Um... Anyway... The power went out, and I've been trying to turn it back on. But it seems like you went one set ahead of me. This was probably just a big inconvenience for you. But I, I appreciate you came here to back me up. As I said, I was afraid I might not come back. But that's not because of these guys or anything. I was just worried I would be too afraid to tell the truth. That I might run away or do something cowardly. Uh, um, I, I suppose I owe you an explanation. A little bit. As you probably know, Asgore asked me to study the nat nature of souls. During my research, I isolated a power called Determination. I injected it into the dying monsters so their souls would at least last after death. But the experiment failed. You see, unlike humans, monsters' bodies don't have enough physical matter to take those concentrations of determination. Their bodies started to melt, and I lost what physicality they had. Pretty soon, all of the test subjects had melted together into those. Seeing them like this, I, I knew I couldn't tell their families about it. I couldn't tell anyone about it, no matter how much everyone was asking me. And I was too afraid to do any more work, knowing everyone would... Everything I'd done so far had been such a horrific failure. 
But now... Now I've changed my mind about all this. I'm going to tell everyone what I've done. Uh, it's going to be hard. Being honest, believing in myself. I'm sure there will be times where I struggle. I'm sure there will be times where I screw up again. But knowing deep down that I have friends to fall back on, I know it'll be a lot easier to stand on my own. Thank you. Come on, guys. It's time for everyone to go home. Power's been turned on. That's creepy. Entry number eight. I've chosen a candidate. I haven't told Asgore yet, because I wanted to surprise him with it. In the center of a garden, there's something special. The first golden flower that grew before all the others. The flower from the outside world. It appeared just before the queen left. I wonder... What happens when something without a soul gains the will to live? Entry number 18. The flower's gone. Oh no. She did make flowey. Ring. It's a voice you have never heard before. Adam, are you there? It's been a long time, hasn't it? But you've done well. Thanks to you, everything has fallen into place. Adam, see you soon. Whoa! Uh, so the elevator just freaks out and goes up again? Or down? The door is jammed shut with vines. Oh no. Toriel? Nobody picked up. Papyrus and Undyne. There's no response. Crap. Can I go this way? God, no. All right. Okay, hang on. Is there a... There was a save point there once before. It's not there anymore. Okay. Seems like I don't have any options, right? I mean, I probably can go back to the normal town... That save point's gone, too. There was one right there. It's gone. Is this genuinely it this time? Should I... I should... I feel like I need to go home. Okay. Um, I don't know. Should I go back to town? Maybe build up a stock of stuff. Uh, can I even go back to town? I don't know. Let me try, because... Do I have... Stained apron? Old tutu. Let me... Let me give it a shot. Because... I'm not... I don't want to fight Asgore again. Empty-handed, you know? I want to... I want to have some healing stuff. Mm. Since I had to spend some of my star phase to get there, I don't want to be empty-handed when I fight him. You know, does that make sense? I think it makes sense. Come on. 
Please let me out. Oh, that's right. Crap. That was the only exit, huh? Okay. Wait, is there... Is there another exit over here, maybe? Hopefully? Or does this just loop around? I think it just loops around. I feel like there were two exits out of this place, which is probably completely incorrect. This is different. I don't remember this. What the heck? Oh, yeah. Hmm. I remember this now. It's probably just going to spit me back right out where I was. Yeah, this is... Uh, dang it. Oh, man. M maybe. 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 Maybe I, get, I might get lucky and, like be able to get out and get some healing items maybe because i really need them will this will this take me out crap okay fine i might have to cut this episode a little bit short while i ponder what to do next i'm not Hmm. Yeah. So, we're going to return to the save point after I completely just wandered around. It's the end. So, uh, all right. I guess I'm going <laughs> to, going to call it here, guys. Take care, be safe, stay determined, and I'll see you next time.